Hello wonderful little beans, my name is B and welcome back to another video. If you're new here, don't forget to subscribe, turn on post notifications for more daily Royal High videos and of course use that code B when buying Robux or Premium. Little beans, I am so sorry that I wasn't available to cover this new update for you. In case you can't tell from my voice, I am still very very sick. I feel like I'm getting worse every day at the moment. I've been spending most of my time resting but thank you so much to James for covering the update for me. But just in case, I do want to obviously do an in-depth video for you guys as well. Since obviously I wasn't able to when the video came out, James did mention in the video that I would probably do a video for you guys too, so I'm definitely going to. So that all means the castle's heart has been updated. Interestingly, skipping Royal High's New Year's update entirely and going straight for a Valentine's Everfriend theme. As you guys can see, the entire realm has been redesigned with beautiful flowers and gorgeous pink colours, symbolising what would usually be obviously Valentine's, but with some of the Valentine's aspects removed in place of what they're trying to do which is their ever friend theme obviously the goal with this update is to essentially start to remove those old classic real life holidays from Royal High and transfer them over to their official holidays that they have themselves so obviously we already did that with the evening fall update for Halloween instead it was called evening fall and of course for Halloween and then they did the same thing for Christmas with glitter frost for winter and then royal days for the official Royal High winter update which technically is a Christmas update but you know obviously they want to move away from real world names for things this one is the everfriend update and they haven't revealed yet if there's an actual event some people have theorized some names for what it could be called which are all kind of really complicated ones since most of them need to start with royale so it'd be kind of like realitines or something like that kind of a complicated name if you ask me but we'll have to wait and see what they are planning on doing so the castle's heart is completely redesigned and by the time you're actually watching this video because i'll need to edit it and nerd out it will take me a while because I am still sick. This will probably be updated with the new shop changeover as well. If it isn't yet, then you'll see the same menus as me, but if it is updated, then you will see these things for sale. So of course, it will include all of the Valentine's previous year's accessories that were previously purchasable, other than the exclusive ones like original Teddy Zilla or the original Parasol. Everything else will be on sale. Now, obviously, that means that the wings will go back on sale as well, the ones you're used to for Valentine's Day, sold in January and February. So obviously, those will be back as well but there are actually some new things as well little beans that people aren't really talking about if you go over to the locker and then door decals and scroll down you'll be able to find that there are actually are some that are sold specifically in january and february so as you can see this pretty the baby pink version of the princess lights door is january and february rather than the rest of them which are march and april and if you scroll down you'll find the beautiful fuzzy teddy bear locker doors these ones are all available in january and february too so these are all of the official ones for the ever friend season and they're all based on fuzzy teddy bears and cute stuff there's little hearts on them and little gifts as if it's like a valentine's theme and of course the flowers that we see inside of the beautiful new castles heart redesign in addition to that you guys if it's it's out by then there is also something for the art classes now obviously the art class may not be out in time for this but if it does come out in time during the everfriend update the dear dolly frilly art borders will be available for you to buy with your paint kits once this update actually comes out so there are actually some new things inside this update that will come out in the shop as well it's not just a redesigned realm but we don't know yet if there will be anything else obviously the christmas tree is gone and nothing has been placed in its place so i'm wondering if maybe they're going to put something there in the future maybe there's going to be something special for each seasonal holiday but maybe they're waiting till february time to release it because that's when the events would happen obviously technically glitter frost is november and december but we didn't get the royal holidays update till december and technically the evening fall update obviously spreads across two months as well for september and october but we didn't actually get anything until october so technically speaking you guys these seasons do have events in them that usually happen on the month where the real life event happens so if, if the beautiful valentine's update obviously everfriend comes out the season will be january and february but likely the actual holiday celebration or event would be just february so we'll have to wait and see we don't know yet if anything like that is going to come but for the time being this is everything that's out right now you guys can come and explore the beautiful redesigned castle's hat now and of course the updated shop that has some new things for your lockers and of course some old things re-released from previous years now one thing i do wonder is if the chest locations are still here oh interesting the chest's gone 
So they've actually removed the chest that was in here because obviously that was a glitter frost chest. And I'm curious now as well, does that mean that they have removed the chest that you walk up this or fly up this thing for? Because obviously if you remember up there, it's kind of snowy and glitter frosty. So it wouldn't make sense if they removed it. So you can still light the fire and it still opens the hole. Let's go see what's up inside, shall we? Oh, uh, it's a solidified. You can't go up there anymore. It like opens it up, but there's nowhere to go. So they have actually removed all of the chest locations in this update too. Interesting. Well, there you go, you guys. There's the updated Valentine's Castle's hat. I hope you guys enjoy taking your beautiful pictures inside of it. And obviously, I assume the rest of the castle will update too. I don't think they've gone around to updating the rest because as you guys can see, when you go to the map, it is still wintry and nothing else has released yet. So I imagine just like with Glitterfoss, they'll release things slowly. And I imagine when we tick over to the 1st of January, we'll also see the menu on the side back update. So we'll have to wait and see for that too. But thank you so so much for watching little beans if you enjoyed this video don't forget to leave a like subscribe and click that bell you stack up be when buying web or premium and i'll see you guys next time have a great day everybody goodbye